Good evening, everybody. It is 10.15 here in Florida, and blessings. Okay, you guys, I just want to bring you a little something this evening to give you encouragement. Now, we don't know uh, when the Lord's coming back, but what we can do is just hope and pray and watch. But anyways, this is from our brother Paul, and he's, he sent this to me yesterday. And uh, this says, hmm, so meant to tell you morning of May 23rd, I didn't see anything, but I heard 10 days. Then I was calculating it in my sleep and said, June 2nd. I don't know, Sherry. Just wanted to let you know that. And then this also says here, and this is from a video, and I don't know who the video belongs to, but this is a sister. Her name is Sarah Mia, and uh, this says, this was very compelling. Two nights ago, I had a dream after crying to God in prayer about how much longer <laughs> I get it, sister. And um, then she says, I dreamed the U.S. was under attack. I saw bombs being dropped, smoke and fire everywhere. Then I woke up saying, stay away from New York the first week of June. I have been thinking nonstop about this for the past two days. I have seen many, many videos of the rapture taking place June 15th, Pentecost, Feast of Weeks, that are also compelling. But my dream left me wondering why is judgment coming before then? So, we're going to go somewhere else. Okay, if you hear my doggy snoring in the background, it's been a very, very tiring month and a half, you guys, for us. I'm not going to go into all of it, but anyways... This apparently is on the same video, and this is from T.I. Duncan. And I'm just going to say right here, God bless the body of our Lord Jesus Christ. And all glory goes to God, our Lord, Father, God. Okay, so anyways, this says, I learned a few years ago that the first Feast of Weeks in Israel as a nation began on June 2nd, 1949. The permanent government was seated on the new year of the trees or 2 14 49 and another sister also had uh 2 14 uh that's february 14th of course and uh and i have done many uh video well, not many quite a few different videos on the new year of the trees also known as purim and then also it says thereby fulfilling the requirements of a nation and the sign was a blood moon the following Passover, three days prior to the 70th anniversary, which is Daniel's 70th week. The 21st Knesset dissolved on May 30th, 2019. This might go along with what you are bringing forth with your June 1st finding. Somehow, as I was watching your video, I got a strong impression to go measure from the day the Christ angle alignment happened, 9-2017, to sundown June 2nd which would be the 73rd anniversary of the first Feast of Weeks as a nation and was stunned to see it will be exactly 1,717 days. 1717, you guys. And then it says in the Strongs, that is manifest. Two seventeens. Two seventeen was Noah's flood. The 17th was Resurrection Day. Uh, and then it says, is this double 17 showing it will be the sleeping in Christ day to resurrect as well. And then he also says here, this also gives way for the final seven years of Jacob's trouble to fulfill the 10 year span of a generation in Psalm 9010. And speaking of Noah's flood, okay, about 10 days ago, I had a dream. I was in a store, and he was there with me, and, well, it was a very short dream. Again, if you're hearing my dog snoring, you guys, I'm so sorry, <laughs> but anyways, um, I was in the store, and I was talking to quite a few different women, and um, we were talking about the end times, and Andy left, and then he came back in the store, and he said to me, I just saw Noah's flood. And I could see the picture of the ark like it was being shown in front of me. And I was like, wow. 
And I had that dream out of nowhere, you guys. And I've had several confirmations on that at this point. Now, what does that mean? Well, that's talking about judgment, y'all. That's talking about something uh, happening on this earth that the Lord is, well, he's going to He's gonna have it to happen. Anyways, I want to share this also. This is from our brother Paul. And this says, had a dream last night that I know is connected to this. I don't know what it means, but I know it's connected. I dreamt I was outside looking at the sky. I was, it was really dark and there were tons of satellites floating in the dark sky. But floating out of control, they were really big satellites. They began going into each other and got tangled from what it looked like. And they all began falling towards the earth. So we're going to go one more place and then we'll be done. Okay, so this says China versus Elon Musk. Scientists develop plan to destroy Starlink satellites. And then it's also down here, it says uh, a team of Chinese researchers has reportedly published a study calling for anti-satellite capabilities that could disable Elon Musk's Starlink satellites if deemed necessary. So I just want to bring all this to you guys, not setting a date. We're just watching for the Lord Jesus Christ to come. I don't know when. All I know is a lot of times we need to see things in the spirit as in, I'll, I'll, I'll give you an example. Let's say uh, somebody has a dream of Christmas. Well, that might just mean Christ Mass, meaning the gathering of the children. Anyways, God bless you. I pray this uh, blesses you in your late night. And uh, thanks to everybody in this video. Uh, Y'all have a beautiful night in our Lord Jesus. Amen and amen.